so I have to come and make this video, right? Because listen, I come up me out today because. Oh, you know what? Let's turn this into a chit chat video. Let's get into the intro and we'll get started. Let's go. So this wasn't intended intended to be a the whole video. It's just something that first time I'm going to try and I was going to make a video. But then I said a week. Last week chit chat video was me talking about my experiences where I keep having visions and you know forewarning of stuff and how people react when I tell them about it and, and that kind of thing. So what I forgot to mention in that video was that week I had a dream there was a goldish brownish casket and there was this aged guy in the casket all I was seeing was the top of his head right and this had a little ball spot right there and a little you know some people just have a little gray green around the ball spot so that's all I was seeing in the casket it was a nice sandy brown yet goldish color casket and the only people that was in the funeral was my daughter's family, was real close family. So I was like, okay, I got up and I told my daughter, I said, Afia, and she know when she hear Afia. Her name is Akila Afia. But she know when she hear Afia, it's serious. Cause, and she just tell everybody at all, yeah, when mommy say Afia, you know, she either angry or something, but, but real serious. So I say Afia. Somebody in your family went and die, you know. And she's like, oh God, what happened? What's your dream, man? I said, well, like, you know, I see this man in the casket, but the only people that was there in that funeral was just your family. It was just your family. And one of my brother was there, and he gave, he, he was driving me around that day. And she was like, oh gosh, mommy, who is this? And then it was about five days later, her grandfather, brother, passed away. I said, well, finally, we know who it is. I, I mean, it came across real rough the way I said it, but I just, because I know it's somebody really close, it's either on her, her father's side or my side, but I know it's family, real family, close family coming, going on that. It was real, but I meant. And then when I hear who it is, I was like, okay. So that is what that is, that is who the woman was about, but it wasn't just him. Then, uh, about the same amount of time, about five days later, also, <laughs> that same uncle, opposite to him, his friend, and is everybody friend, the family friend, passed away. Young boy, her father age, her father age group. And my daughter, father, age group, they were best friends. He also passed away. And then, in the street where I am from, in Miaro, my neighbor in front of me, her son, passed away. It was just a whole chain. I was like, wait, papa. And it's just something about living in a small community that I have noticed in Mayaro. 
Listen, when one person is about to die, they always would go with a whole fleet of people. And all these people were connected because they were all friends. All the individuals that I mentioned who just died were connected by family and friends. Right? That's how close net it is. And they all gone. All, all of them. All three of them. But getting back to today's video. So if you haven't seen last week's video, go and check it now. It's in the cards above, you know, right, right on the screen right there. Go check it out. And yeah, okay. So while anyway coming up the road to attend her uncle's funeral, um, there is a long standing roti shop. Uh, since I was a child, this roti shop there. So I think is a is is the children who run in the shop now, right? She told me that they have shrimp roti. Now I have never eaten, tasted, smelled, see a shrimp roti. So I just hot up my roti. So let us give it a try and see how the shrimp roti tastes. Huh? Give it a try. And they're a red packet there, a red packet. And the good thing is they was closing up now. So normally a shrimp roti is all kind of 40 something dollars. This shrimp roti because it was there was closing up $25. What you tell in your whole self? Alright, let me give it a taste. Bad, tasting good, but I'm tasting them, ma'am. And not tasting, ma'am. So I'll go now. Thanks for watching this video. <laughs> and again, check out my <clears throat> check out my um other video that I just mentioned. All right. I see you next week. Another episode of Chocolate Down. Cha-cha. Bye now.